Hello and welcome. This is Chandni Nevdani and you are watching It's Tomorrow News. 11 dead as winter storm threatens millions of Americans. At least 11 people have died on icy roads in Kansas, Nebraska and Missouri in the US as a wave of deadly storms hit the Midwest and Northeast. The wintry weather was part of a storm system that hit parts of the Midwest and was expected to extend into the Northeast through Tuesday, the National Weather Service said. In Missouri, the storm dumped from 3 to 9 inches of snow across a large swath of the state. Much of Missouri was under either a winter weather advisory or winter storm warning on Monday. A trail of stranded cars was left behind because of the storm, the Missouri State Highway Patrol said. Three people were killed on Sunday night when a driver lost control and overturned on the U.S. 67 in San Francois County in the eastern part of the state. A motorist who was stranded after a previous crash and two good Samaritans who were trying to help was struck. In mid Missouri, Callaway County, an 18-year was killed when his vehicle went off the side of Missouri 94 and overturned. The patrol also said in a tweet on Monday morning that it had responded to over 660 calls from stranded motorists and to 685 other traffic crashes. The University of Missouri started classes late on Monday because of the storm. In Kansas, the storm brought up to 11 inches of snow. The Kansas Department of Transportation said multiple roads are partially or completely covered with snow. In Utah, a snowboarder died after an avalanche in the back country. Authorities are now warning of a high early avalanche danger following the first fatality of the season. The storm is heading east. Moderate to heavy snow could fall from St. Louis to Indianapolis on Monday, CBS News Climate and Weather reports. On Monday night, snow could move into New York City and Scranton, Pennsylvania, but it would be quickly be followed by rain as milder air moves in. On Tuesday morning, snow was expected in Boston, Scranton and Albany, New York. That's all for now. For more news updates, stay tuned with us. It's Tomorrow News, Chani Nebnani. For more weather updates, do like, share and subscribe our channel.